Fox News saying it's issued a weather alert day tonight through tomorrow morning with lots of snow coming to the Cascades. Fox 13's Dave Detling joins us live with a look at the conditions in Snoqualmie Pass. Dave. Hey there. Well, right now we've got that snow coming down. Not so big in terms of the snowflake big chunks, but it is enough to coat the roadways on our drive up along I-90. We definitely saw people taking it easy. The speed has been reduced to 45 miles per hour because of the uh, wet and slick conditions. We saw a lot of tractor trailer drivers pulling off to the side of the road and putting those chains on the tires. WashDOT encouraging and demanding that all tractor trailer drivers be making sure that those tires are ready for these slick conditions. Uh, the roadways, no major reports of any accidents. That wasn't the case earlier today. Any of those uh, t those uh, tractor trailers that weren't prepared, uh, there were some spin outs forcing the closure of I-90. But again, uh, that has since been cleared. But if you take a look behind me, you can see what the area looks like at this rest stop right here. We've got some heavy equipment making sure that the uh, snow is being cleared from this residential area. The snow is definitely coating here as it can continues to come down. But again, the name of the game as we go into this winter weather is making sure people stay safe. Wait, Wash dot giving these tips for drivers to stay safe. And then when you do travel up here, you know, is your gas tank full? Do you have some supplies if things go south? Stop driving up on Stokomi Pass with bald tires and then follow our restrictions. If it's not, if it says traction tires required, that means traction tires are required. And WashDOT saying if people follow these types of rules and regulations, they, of course, will minimize any road closures. But again, here live where we are, you can see the snow continues to come down. We will continue to monitor the snowfall and any accidents that come this way. We're live. Dave Detling, Fox 13 News. Dave, thank you so much and be careful out there.